Uf, wow. Uf. Hey everyone, welcome back to JR Pro Shop Vids. Today we got the brand new 900 Global Eternity. So let's talk a bit more about the design of this bowling ball. So the new Eternity here features the S84 Response Pearl cover stock. It's the same cover stock that was found on the Altered Reality. For that reason, we're gonna compare it against another reality ball, the Reality Check. Now the core designs are a bit different in these. This Epoch core rolls a little bit sooner compared to the Disturbance core that's found in the Reality series. And the other ball he's gonna compare with today is the Absolute from Storm. Now this features the R2S Deep Hybrid cover stock. Now with it being on the weaker side, we should see a little bit more length and less overall hook versus the Eternity. So because we're testing out some stronger bowling balls today, Junk's gonna bowl on 45 foot Route 66. Now this is a longer pattern that doesn't have a ton of volume, so a shiny ball like the Eternity will really come in handy. A special thanks to all of the members who have joined our community so far. If you wanna be a part of it, get early access to video, coaching, merch, and so much more, hit that join button below. That's enough in here, let's head out to Jungo on the lanes. Jungle is back again. 900 Global Eternity.
Pretty good shot. Where it's a little bit too far left. So I think I'm gonna have to slow the ball speed down a little bit, get around it a little more, and have it corner down lane and hook a little bit more. All right, much better. So a little speed adjustment, a little rotation adjustment, and that ball is still cornering really hard down lane. No sign of a 10 pin, driving straight through the pins. Really good sign. So strike from there, let's go three more to the left. Wow, the ball's still hooking, still going through the pins really well. That is crazy. That ball hooks a ton. If you need a ball that hooks in the back end, get the eternity. Okay, so just for reference, let's throw the reality check and the absolute on that line. So we're nine boards further left than the last time we threw these balls. And we'll probably still hit the pocket just because we're not giving the pocket away too much, but you can really see the way it will go through the pins will be a lot different. All right, as you can see, has a little bit more mid lane roll, the reality check, and not enough pop down lane. It's gonna swisher seven, swisher 10 all day. I'm just too far left for that ball. So the absolute should be a little worse, actually. Okay, really good shot there with the absolute. As you can see, it's really light. Comes in kind of behind the head pin. Got a light strike, got lucky to get that. And you can just see the reaction difference when it goes through the pins. Eternity versus the reality check first the brand new Storm Absolute. So definitely a spot in the bag for the Absolute and the Eternity. And it's the reality check just fits right in the middle. I don't think I'll take all three, but let's throw one more with the Eternity, send it back to the shop. I'm gonna move four boards back to the right. This is probably the happy zone right here for it. Ooh. Head back to the shop. All right, we're back from the lanes throwing the brand new Eternity. Man, this ball hooks a ton. This has got to be one of the most hookingest balls I've ever thrown. It's going to rival the Proton Physics. As you can see from a lot of videos before, I throw that a lot. I throw it a lot against the new stuff. And the Proton Physics outhooks every ball. This ball's a little bit different. It's shiny. It goes a little bit further down lane. And most of the hook happens at the back end. For it to cover this many boards, man, this ball is crazy. We put out a long pattern, Route 66. It is more on the difficult side, so not a lot of error room, which I like to test balls on things like that because that's what tournaments are on. I don't bowl many tournaments on house conditions, so I'm always testing it on sport or challenge and this ball hooks a lot. So there's like an average amount of oil on Route 66, but it's a really long pattern. So the ball does skid pretty far before it hooks, especially on the fresh. And the Eternity here digs in, man. It digs in hard at the back end, really turns a corner, and I'm able to create that good entry angle from playing those inside angles. Sometimes those angles are kind of hard to create using like a, a solid ball, an asymmetrical solid ball. Sometimes they just roll a little bit too early, they don't corner enough in the back end. And then something weaker, like a symmetric pearl, like a phase five, it's just not enough ball. It just doesn't hook enough boards. I have to play a little bit too straight and it's just not the ideal line to play. But this Eternity on this pattern, I was able to play inside, right where the pattern wants me to play, and it's able to turn the corner, and man, it goes through the pins amazing. As Barker explained in the intro, compared it against Reality Check, really close bowling ball, but as you can see, the Reality Check's just a little smoother, a couple boards less hook. Definitely can't get as far left with it as it can with the Eternity. I also threw the Absolute, one of my favorite asymmetrical shiny balls of late. I use it all the time actually in league. This ball works really well in long patterns as well, but as you can see in the video, it just, it doesn't hook as much as the Eternity. The shape on this, the colors are really great, just the Eternity outhooks it by four or five boards easy. So if you're out there and you're having trouble making the ball hook down lane, I think you gotta get an Eternity. So some other bowlers this Eternity would be good for, uh, guys with a little bit more forward roll that have trouble creating that back end snap and also with people with a little bit higher ball speeds who need a little bit more ball reaction down lane especially if you're bowling on something that's a little bit more high friction some of the AMF synthetic lanes or wood lanes or something like that you need a ball that corners a little more down lane I think you got to get this eternity as well drill it pin up watch it hook so just one last thing, further to the left I got with my feet with this ball, the slower I threw it, the more I rotated it. It just kept hooking, kept going through the pins really well. As you can see during the end part of the video of me throwing shots there, I kept moving three with my feet, kept the break point around the same and the ball just kept finishing right through the pins. No sign of a 10 pin, so that was good. Can really manipulate this ball really well. It responds well, hooks a lot. You're gonna love it if you need a ball that hooks in the back end. That's enough from Jungle, thanks for watching. Check out our brand new shirt designs, sweaters, T-shirts, shop at jrproshop.com.
But let us know if you like the designs. Comment down below. Ask us any questions you got. You can find us on every social media platform. Thanks for watching. See you in the next video.